Santa Barbara offers its residents a unique experience in having lots of art. But every second Saturday, you can come down to the Funk Zone Art Walk and meet the artists on a personal level. So, how has the artwork been for you today? Yes, that's right. In Santa Barbara's Funk Zone, art speaks to our community. And with Second Saturdays, the community is invited to share in a creative dialogue like never before. This is the first Second Saturday Funk Zone uh, Art Walk. It's kind of the art community coming together. Second Saturdays, I think, is a really great idea because when you have 18 different venues open, you get a huge variety of people. And now all of a sudden you've got 18 other artists who have their clientele who go, well, let's go look at Michael Irwin Studios or let's go look at the Art Foundry. The Funk Zone is a whole new world all of a sudden. We have watercolors. You know, this is the first one that we've had and already there have been more people that have come through this one gallery than I've seen in a really long time down here. Um, I really like the fact that it's during the day. Um, I think for people that want to dip their toe into the art world, meet artists personally, not necessarily have a, 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 like the museum where there's a sort of this perceived membrane and it's a little colder. It can develop into something that just be an interesting second neighborhood uh, as opposed to just State Street. We have something else to offer. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's a new one. Second Saturdays in the Funk Zone. The Funk Zone has always been a place where creativity thrives. And with increasing popularity, the goal is to keep art alive and engaging for a thirsting public. I think it's important also to bring awareness to the arts in the Funk Zone neighborhood. Trying to nurture and promote the artists here is really important. Having an outlet for the community to really enjoy that creative, you know, creative identity here I think is is valuable. We have all these kind of hidden art galleries and artist studios. New new artists, new work. Musical shows, performances. It's going to happen every second Saturday. And really trying to just create this festival atmosphere on a monthly basis. It's a good worthwhile way to spend a Saturday afternoon at least once a month. What makes it funky, what makes this zone is the people and the artwork that they create. Fuck zone. <laughs> the Arts Fund is hosting uh, an improv show and spoken word from students from UCSB next month. Great opportunity to come down and see a lot of art, a lot of art studios, and a lot of artists. So come on down and visit. Come visit Second Saturdays in the Funk Zone. But there's a lot of affordable art here, man. Like, there are people pumping out stuff that are just incredibly prolific. So I would say that, you know, Come down, walk around, and yes, there are a bunch of wineries and there are breweries, and and that's awesome too. But there's a there's a lot of art, and it's uh, everyone's really nice too.